When Venus passes directly between Earth and the Sun, we see the distant planet as a small dot gliding slowly across the face of the Sun. Historically, this rear alignment is how we measured the size of our solar system. The next transit of Venus occurs June the 5th or the 6th, 2012, depending on your location. Observers in North America uh, see, uh, will see in the evening of June the 5th. This will be the last transit of Venus uh, to occur in your lifetime. Much of the world can witness the 2012 transit of Venus. The date depends on what side of international dateline you will be observing. Observing in North America will see the transit in the evening of June the 5th uh, through sunset, so you want to have a clear western horizon. Now why I'm saying this? To avoid people will start saying, oh, the 5th and the 6th of June, or will, uh, Nibiru will be visible, and that will be Nibiru, and all that crap you people, uh, uh, I already predict you will say. Some of you already said that, so, so just, you know, let's get it clear, it will be Venus. You can follow its transit, you can follow its path, its orbit, and you will see it will be Venus. There will be no Nibiru, Nibiru doesn't exist, so stop, uh, 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 stop messing about that, stop talking about it uh, it just it just doesn't exist it can't exist we said it many times every time every time there's some uh, uh, all your videos are, are just lens flares or, or the black dot and, and and nothing else it's always like the story like the story of the uh, uh, um, horned planet that will be Venus too so uh, uh, and, there, and there was another was not episode of a guy uh, taking a picture of Venus he didn't know what it was and say I can debunk NASA but I don't know what that is. Well, if you don't know what that is, how can you debunk NASA in the first place? That was Venus, and Venus, uh, uh, and will be Venus again to kick your ass.